rectangles, rhombuses, and squares. There are many special types of parallelograms, such as rectangles. As you might remember, rectangles are parallelograms, where all the angles of the intersecting sides are right angles. In order for a shape to be a rectangle, it must satisfy all the properties of parallelograms, quadrilaterals, and polygons. Rhombuses are also special types of parallelograms, where all of their sides are equal in length, and they satisfy all the features of parallelograms, quadrilaterals, and polygons. This shape here is a rhombus, while this shape here is a parallelogram, but it is not a rhombus because its sides are not equal. Also, it is not a rectangle because its angles are not right angles. What about this shape? Well, it should be very familiar to you. It is a square. Notice that all of its sides are equal in length. And all of its angles are right angles. Not only that, but the opposite sides are parallel as well. So, we can say it is a parallelogram because the opposite sides are parallel. We can also call it a rectangle because it is a parallelogram with four right angles. And we can call it a rhombus because all of the sides are equal. So a square is a special type of parallelograms, rectangles, and rhombuses. In this lesson, you learned about squares and their relation to other types of quadrilaterals.